This tune is called Silver Spear. It's an old Irish traditional tune. At one point it was very popular and it kind of goes in and out as, uh, as time goes on. But it's uh, still listed as one of the top 10 Irish traditional tunes to learn. And here it is. A little bit slow, but here it is. The A part of the tune is, and the B part of the tune have similar hammer patterns. This is a very melodic traditional Irish tune, so there's not much point in trying to chord around it or try to learn it through chording. This is basically learn the melody and bang it out correctly. The way, um, at least for the hammer dulcimer, that makes it easy for me, and again, this is uh, somewhat opinionated is to start with a left hand on the F sharp. If you do that you're going to end up with uh, what in essence is uh, sort of a triplet up here. Now one way to run this video is to let me do a phrase, I'll pause a little bit, allow you to shut it off, work that phrase, and then we can go on to the next phrase. So your first phrase is going to be this. You're going to hit this Okay, so it starts out here. One, two. So you're going to be hitting this five times, but you're going to be hitting it with the right hand. One, one. And that's your first phrase. Your second phrase is going to be sliding right over here to the D. So you're going to so we'll start out here. So we'll, we'll put the first phrase. We go over here to the D. So I'm going to hit the, hit the D, go right up here to the F sharp, walk it down, then go. Then I'm going to skip the C sharp, go right on here to the B, walk it up, and then back to the B. And that's going to lead into the next part. And you're going to do the same thing again. Now this time, this is going to be a little bit different. A little simpler. So you can again hit the D, go up to the F sharp and walk it down. Again you're going to skip that C sharp there. You're going to do it again. Now now over here you're going to do it again. So again here we go. D, F sharp, walk it down. Now back down here to the B. So it's going to be down here to the B, back up here to the D, walk it, and then what you're going to do is uh, essentially a descending third. Now watch that again. Now I'm going to be on the right hand up here on the G. Then now, now this, watch this little uh, thing right here. Again, I'm going to stop this or stop this if you need to to work on it, but it's now to the B part. You're going to do the same thing you did here with the left hand starting down here at the F sharp. You're going to do the same thing. So you're basically running over and up an octave, and it works like this. Now, 
that's the first phrase. That's the same thing here. So you're going to bring it down, skip it down, and then roll it back up. We'll try it again. Now walk it down. Then down here to the B. And once again, right up here again to the F sharp. Boy, you hit that C sharp and it's going to sound horrible. Let's try that phrase again, that whole thing again. Now walk it down. Skip the C sharp and walk it up. Do it again. Now walk it down. Skip the C sharp. The last part of the B. Now I'm going to skip that C sharp. C sharp seems to be bad news for this. Now again, I'm going to skip it back up. So I'm going to skip that C sharp going up. And then finish it up. I want to show you this this part here. It, it I've I learned it years ago on another tune, and that's the really cool part about a hammer dulcimer is once you learn a pattern for one tune, it really goes over to another other tune quite easily. Drop it down. I drop. Bring this one up, and I slide over here. Now, why I don't go down there? It's nice and tight. And if I'm over here, then I'm going to go into the next time around for the second time through. I'm right back down here. Right? And that's basically Silver Spear. Good luck with it.